Jason Gonzalez. I told everyone that he's my favorite. I told everyone that he was gonna go deep like he did. Thank you. Thank went you. deep. How many times? Tell them how many times you went. Uh, they said 12, but I think I got 13 in there. Just leave the park. They left the country pretty much. They're gone. These balls, they haven't landed yet. He's got some real manpower straight to dead center. How you feeling right now? Uh, I feel good. I feel good. You know, there's still still a lot of guys uh, guys that come up and, and hit some, but uh, I feel good right now. I feel really good. You've got a good shot at winning. Uh, thank you. Thank nice you. work. Derby as you put on a clinic in the blast motion home run derby during the season. What you could hit 15 then? Uh something like that, yeah. Yeah, so you just get up there and you hit 11. You're in second after Gonzalez just put on a clinic, but then sort of you packing them up, you're showing real man strength right there. You just you're a veteran. How are you feeling right now? I'm tired. Yeah. I'm yeah. Tired. How do you feel in the next round? I think you'll get there. If I make it. You make it. Hopefully I win then. <laughs> I think you can get the energy right back. Yeah. 10 home runs in regular season, 11 right air. I think you'll win the, what, regular season home run round? Hopefully, yeah. yeah. Keep it up, good right. luck. Thank you. Good luck. All right, here with Ben Maycock. Just hit six deep, some real main strength. That's a big trend going on right here in the home run derby so far. Hitting two out with a broken bat, how'd that feel? Didn't feel that well off the bat. Definitely couldn't have felt good. It's a travel pretty far. <laughs> Why didn't you just step out and be like, give me a new one? I don't know. It felt like it was coming off almost bad. It was weird. You just wanted to get that clean break, yeah. maybe? Immediately once you got the new bat, you sent one probably through Matt's car windshield <laughs> way out there. Yeah. Uh, I mean, right now he's tied up with Kato with six. Let's see what happens. Yeah. The rounds go on. Well, best of luck. Thank you. Nice work. Thank you. Congrats. Jason Gonzalez, 15 home runs in the final round of the 2017 Last Motion Home Run Derby, and that's good enough to be the champ, as I predicted. Hate to say I told you so, but I told you so. We saw you early on, right at the scout stage. How many hacks did you think you took there? Uh, at the at the scout stage? Yeah, early on, probably like 20, right? Yeah, yeah, just about. Yeah. 20 hacks. Mm -hmm. You come in here, obviously you took your warm-up hacks before. Uh -huh. I mean, you, you probably swung the bat pretty much all day long. Yeah, yeah, yeah pretty much. Uh, got here pretty early, you know. Um, I, try, I try to get get ready for the scout day. You know, I put put my cleats on just like a regular day and just try to enjoy the day and then. Got uh, got invited to the home run derby and the rest is history. <laughs> <laughs> and the final round, you called timeout with probably two minutes left. You only had two home runs. Were you sweating? Uh, yeah, yeah, a little bit. But you know, I, I try to relax as much as possible. Uh, I try to square the ball up as much as possible, and uh, and I did so. So it was a lot of fun. Make any adjustments? Uh, yeah, yeah. The first round, I was a little nervous. You know, uh, a lot of adrenaline pumping in my body. But uh, that, that second round, I just try to relax as much as possible, try to have as much fun as, fun as I can, and it's a beautiful love. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 2017 Last Motion Home Run Derby champ. Thank you. Thank you. All right, Billy Brunstrom here with the owners of the Blues, Steve Elliott and David Elliott is, what are you again, Elliott? The corporate? He's a Capricorn. <laughs> Capricorn. No, I'm not. I mean, what do I do? Is it part of no, part your ownership wise. I was just reading up We're on all you. Equal. All equal. Yeah. All equal here. Steve and David are brothers, correct? Yes, that's right. You guys are brothers. Well, he's been nominated for 24 Grammys. He's won eight of them. He's stingy. Right? I don't blame my him. Name on there. Do not blame him. 26. Yeah. Oh, 26. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now you guys have owned the Blues for three years, correct? Yes. Yeah. Tell us what it is like to have the All-Star Game of 2017 here at Muzzy Field. The All-Star? It's huge for us because we didn't think we'd get it in such a uh, short period of time. But uh, we're pleased to have it here. The, the crowd that's here, the local crowd, is definitely pleased to have it. You know, we handle it a little different than we have in the past. but. You know, it's a big game, big for us. What do you think, what do you expect in the future from the 
come because of this game. You expect it to grow through the stage. You know, you know, it's a great time to showcase not only the talent of the FCBL, but um, really show the field. You know, historical Muzzy Field, Babe Ruth at the first home run here. You know, a lot of history with the Red Sox. And I think it's, um, you know, it's been great um, support of the fans in the city. And, uh, you know, it's, 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 it's all American baseball, you know. And you can bet the, uh, any CBL can't do this. Yeah. Shot right there. No yeah. offense. Love it. No, no, no. Right. Exactly, no. Perfectly said. Definitely the competition is what drives everyone realistically. And to one up another one, this is what we have to do to bring it to Aussie right. Field, the history behind it. And you guys have brought it here and you're doing a tremendous job and everything's coming out great. Yeah, we think so. And Dave said, you know, if we win this season, he's gonna provide the black pants. <laughs> we'll cut that. <laughs> I don't know if that can go on. Well, I, I, I picked out a couple of male dancers. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Hey, he's, he, you know, he's, he's Hollywood, man. He's Equal liberal. rights. You know, I, I live in Greenwich. I'm a Republican. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you know. I surround myself with rich people in a country club. Like he's out there in Hollywood, you know. So we get him a mail dance and we show the word tolerant. Love it, love it. <laughs> Any parting words? Go Blues. Yeah, we'd like to see this go on for some time. You know, all all of us are showing this. We just want to see it go on. Awesome. Yeah. Great yeah, they haven't had baseball here since the Red Sox. Right. You know, an established. Team. So, yeah. um, I mean, I think we've, we've probably spent almost a million dollars in three years. Wow. As scary as that sounds. You know, establishing the team. So, I, I think, and the city has embraced it. And it's great. But it will, you know, you're doing a 2017 business in a 1912 ballpark. So, you yeah. know, there's a lot of challenges. But, I, you know, I think we'll work through them. Uh, but the city loves it, you know, so we're looking forward to it. Great to hear. Well, thank you guys. I well, appreciate it. Thank you to the FCBL. Yeah. Of course, look forward to coming back. Awesome. <laughs> thank you, Lindsay. Thank you, Lindsay. <laughs> Beautiful. Thank you guys. I appreciate it. Thank you, Ellie. We need to put a poll up here. So, yeah, we need to put a poll up here. All right, I'm here with Troy Stefanski, center fielder of the Sharks versus UConn, correct? Yes. And also the MVP of the 2017 FCBL All-Star Game, Joe Silva. Troy, first of all, tell me what this experience was like. Yeah, it was just really nice to come out here and play with, with some great guys, some great talent out here in the Futures League. You know, it's, uh, it's an up-and-coming league for sure, a lot of young talent. Guys can throw the ball, hit the ball, run around. So it's, it was an honor to be out here with some of these guys. It didn't hurt you got the win, right? No, it didn't hurt. It never hurts to win. Winning's fun. And that leads us to Joe Silva who got us the win for the East. Yes. When you had a big two-run jack, only two runs were scored. It was all on Joe. Tell us about the at-bat. Walk us through it. All right, so it's just the uh, first pitch. I was looking for a middle and fastball, and uh, that's what I got. I was able to get enough there on it, and I uh, saw the ball going up. Uh, so I feel they're climbing the fence and uh, it's like, wow, I can't believe this is happening. You should have just pimped it. No, no, you don't want, you don't want to come off as too cocky. I didn't, I didn't fully, uh, I didn't get all the ball. But didn't yeah, think you had it at yeah. first. Wasn't, wasn't sure at first. I knew I hit it well, but I wasn't sure how far I was going to try. What were your feelings today? Oh, uh, just go up and be selective aggressive. You know, swing it at early fastballs so you don't get into late counts. Um, and, you know, that's just kind of been my... Um, baseball's so, got yeah. to be really yeah, dish. You have fun today, boys. Absolutely, had a blast. Great yeah. day, Muzzy. Great time. Earlier today, it's better when you get the win too. 